Where is this guy? Roland Osery? Yes. You must be the new guy. Absolutely. My name is Matthew Lafette. Good to meet you. Here is your assignment for tonight. All right. <clears throat> I just want you to go over that really quickly. All right, I'm looking for a compass. Yeah, the, that's the item of interest tonight. It's a compass. From what our scout says, it's housed in a yellow box. Okay. Um, I just want to let you know that this is a high-risk operation tonight. Y yeah, that's, see, that's what I wanted to talk to you about. Uh, what's up? Uh, high-risk? What, what do you mean? Well, since the owner of the compass left it around so carelessly, we believe it's been assigned a certain guardian. Um, okay. What kind of guardian are we talking we're about? We're believing a spectra class. Maybe a class three, but it's something that we haven't seen before. So that's what makes this so high risk, and it can manifest literally the minute you walk in the door. We don't know how much time you're actually going to have, but we do know it's a strong possibility it's in there. Sounds like a party. Should things go ill, it's policy that I give you this. A rock? Is it just a rock? It's called a flare stone, as corny as that may seem. Some of the guys like to call them light snappers. No, it doesn't have a scent. Um, it's what it's infused with is what's actually going to aid you. You'll have one, maybe two shots before it's exhausted. So just keep that on you. It will begin to emit a glow if the thing is near. I just hope I don't have to use it. Well, hopefully not. We believe the compass is on the second no, floor, no. but you're going to have to... Sur let, let me ask, stop you right there, because why a compass? I mean, shouldn't why I be... A compass? Shouldn't I be looking for some kind of Ouija board, uh, chicken bones, pentagrams, crystals? Why, do you want to? Harry Potter book. I could pick some up later for you if you want. <laughs> Look, it's what's inside the compass is what poses the current threat. Okay. Um, we believe it's on the second floor, but it could have been moved. You have to search the whole house. It's a small, two-level, one-bedroom condo, so you should be in and out. Now, are you sure you want to do this? You're aware of the risks and responsibilities. <laughs> Not entirely sure I'm down with all this shit, but let's go. All right, Roman. I wish you luck. Okay. All right. The address is on the fold. You're going to 52 Narrow Street. All right. 52 Narrows. Got it. And that's pretty much it. Uh, all right. Actually, you know what? There's one more thing. As you know, the last guy who went in here, he had a scurry on out because of the guy who came back early. All right. He had it abort immediately. He had to borrow my flashlight, and he believes that he dropped it on the way out. So if you see it, just, you know, you could pick it up. It's a seven inch, it's seven inches long, it's black, and has a stainless steel striking bezel tip. It's a, it's a combat light. All so right. If you see it, I'm giving you permission to take it. Well, if I see it, I'll get it for you. And I'd like to have it back because it was a gift from one of the higher ups. Uh, no problem. Um, so, ooh, you got an hour. The scout's going to meet up with you there. Good luck. All right. Mission for the flashlight. You'll be mine.